Joe, didn't Trump's grandfather steal Tesla's documents that could have changed the world? So here, here's the deal, okay? So I, I've read every accounting of the latter parts of Tesla's life, okay? He started out very traditionally innovating pro products that exist, um, you know, working things from his imagination, working with electricity, working with the magnetosphere. I mean, really having a lot of uh, practical utility uses for the sciences that he was dabbling. Later in life, he he started dabbling in more uh, idealistic things, things that didn't have a practical use, but he was experimenting. So the Wardenclyffe Towers, have you ever heard of that story? I think you told me about the swaying or something. No, 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 this is, this is oh. he, he, he got funding to build a tower in New York. Okay. Great uh -huh. big needle looking thing. And his, his theory was that we harness the energies that are already surrounding us, the things that are in the atmosphere, the things that are in the ground and being able to distribute electricity by just taking it. At, I mean, okay. So the atmosphere protects us from all of these immense amount of energies, right? If the energies that came at us actually made it to the ground, we'd all be fried and dead. So the atmosphere Yikes. protects us and distributes that energy and dumps it off at the poles and shifts it off to space. Well, Tesla was like, hey, it's already up there. Can we somehow get it from what's already here? Instead of having to generate it through fossil fuels, grab what's already uh, naturally occurring in the atmosphere. Great in theory, right? And yeah. there was a lot of advancement that he made with focusing that energy in the form of early lasers or early particle beams um, and a lot of usages that if you took a guy that wanted to just was fascinated by the curiosities of what he could do and then hand it over to people that could use it for their own you know ends which in yeah. the industrial revolution that's where we were at i mean there were a lot of industrialists who were opportunists rather than scientists